In this video, I'm showing you how to import Photoshop files into Adobe Premiere Pro software so that you can edit them later. First, create the things in Photoshop that you want to import into Adobe Premiere Pro. I created a sample text of three layers followed by one color layer. Total of four layers are there. Don't forget to save the Photoshop file. Now, open the Adobe Premiere Pro software. From the project tab, right click and select the import option. Go to the destination folder where you saved the Photoshop file and select that. You get a pop-up like this. From here, you can select any option. First option is merge all layers, which means every layer is merged and it will show as one photo or one image. The next option is merged layers. This option is for selecting and deselecting the layers that you want and don't want. After that, individual layers option is there. Here, you can manually select which layers you want to import into the software separately. And final option is sequence. It creates all files into one nested clip and automatically create a sequence from this. So you can remove the files later while editing. Below that one more option is there, footage dimensions. Keep it in document size. That is the actual size of the Photoshop layers that you created. Then click on OK. You can see here it is created as a separate folder. If you open this, this is what the sequence is like. Now simply drag and drop into the timeline. If you double tap on the sequence, whatever the layers are there, it will be opened. You can make the changes if you want, but you cannot change the letters in the text. You can change the position, scale, etc. If in case you want to change anything like letters or text, again, you need to open Photoshop and make the adjustments. Do note that even though if you close the Adobe Premiere Pro software, if you make any changes to that particular file, those will be automatically applied to the file that is there in the software. Adobe calls this feature a dynamic link. You can see here, I changed some position of these layers. Now I saved this Photoshop file. In Premiere Pro, it reflects automatically. So this is how you can import the Photoshop file into Adobe Premiere Pro and do the changes. I hope this information is helpful for you. If yes, don't forget to click that like button and also subscribe to this channel for more video editing tips followed by gadget reviews, mobile reviews and more.